hello everyone welcome back on the channel welcome back to another Revisa 3.1.3 frame generation video today we are taking a look at uh, lost records bloom and ridge game is developed in unreal engine 5.2 and as a result as you guys can see my fps is only around 30 uh, now this unreal engine should be called sub 30 fps engine <laughs> uh, so yeah anyway jokes aside uh, let's uh, focus on today's video this game is released back on february 18th uh, this is a similar game to life is strange if you have played that game uh, teenage girls uh, country music supernatural things and etc etc uh, so yeah if you have not tried this game you should try also this game uh, does only have uh, fsr 3 upscaler not the fsr 3.1.3 which is uh, latest so we will be updating that also and also it has only dlss 3.7 so we will be updating that also along with some users are facing crashes after installing the mod i will be addressing that so let's uh, start the video without uh, any delay now first of all you need to set some settings in game in order to escape the crash or avoid the crash so in graphic setting before installing the mod make sure your upscaling is set to default or dlss if you have rtx gpu set it on dlss or if you don't just set it on default but do not set it on fsr3 before installing the mod because after installing the mod the fsr3 the inbuilt fsr3 is bugged so like getting bugged after installing the mod so that's why users are facing crashing issue i will also show you how to switch to dlss after installing the mod so stay tuned for that uh, so so first of all uh, set upscaling to default then quit the game we will be needing this zip lost records b and r bloom and reg uh, extract this zip on the desktop we're gonna copy everything inside then gonna go to the installation directory of the game for me which is here after that uh, uni then binaries win64 and paste the mod here replace the files which it asks for after that run optiscalar setup dot bat in cmd window uh, select uh, one or press one in the cmd window and press enter for dxgi after that uh, select amd or intel or nvidia gpu i have nvidia so i'm pressing two if you have amd or intel you need to press one here then press enter mod now installed now we will run the optiscalar dot ini and set up the frame generation to optifg so run this optiscalar dot ini via any text editor i am just using plain notepad in the frame gen section this section of the text you will see fg type to auto now click on the auto and delete it and type opti fg just like this above text opti fg everything in a small letter no space before or after the text click on file click on save now the mod has installed and the fsr3 has been upgraded to fsr 3.1.3 now i will show you how to uh, upgrade the game's dlss 3.7 to 4.0 with the preset k uh, which is uh, very good in terms of uh, visuals so go to the main installation folder of the game uh, and download the dlss4 from the link in the description extract it copy the dlss4 dll and go to the game's main installation directory after that engine plugin and dlss and you just gotta go forward the way forward like plugins dlss binaries third party win64 etc etc so in the end you will find this dlss you need to paste and replace these files all right now it's uh, replaced uh, now don't skip i will uh, there is work need to be done in the game's main menu so yeah i'll now dive into the game and see how much more fps we're getting and how to avoid the crash and everything updated list of 2025 offline activated and rental and uncracked games is here pause the video choose your game join discord and send message to the cheap games buying channel get windows 10 and 11 microsoft genuine serial key at only 249 rupees all right we are in the main menu now so first thing first before starting the continue you need to click setting go to video and then click on the graphic setting now in here you will see upscaling don't go this way or don't press the arrow key on the right just press the left arrow key or click on this left button it will now select dlss now if you select any more left it will switch to fsr3 and your game will crash so yeah select this dlss uh, after that just go back to the continue checkpoint 
it will take one second i have ssd don't worry as you can see we are back inside the game uh, fps has not improved very much because i am recording and using the dlss4 which is very um, gpu heavy uh, but yeah anyway uh, if you press the ins slash the insert button on your keyboard now opti menu will bring up i will make it a little bit smaller just so you guys can see everything uh, after that we will click on fg active now i'm gonna hide the msi after burner overlay and activate the optis overlay because msi after burner do mess up with the hood all right uh, yeah i have uh, hide the msi after burner overlay now we'll click on fg active and uh, hood fix if you want the optis overlay you can come down here and click on this fps overlay and select this fps overlay enabled select this graph to full and uh, yeah you can just click on save ini now hood fix will work i will show you in a second but let me test the frame rate first it's around 84 85 and yeah without dlss 4 and recording i was getting around 90 95 fps so it's almost uh, 50 percent not 50 100 percent of the fps like from 40 and 45 to 90 uh, now if you want to check the debug view this game does not have uh, much hood but i will show you in a second press ins go to debug view and go near this uh, beer can or the bike you will see uh, like the right bottom one is with the hood the only hood right now you can see is the beer can examine option or near this bike you can see only this reminis or what does it say motorcycle uh, only this hood uh, so yeah the hood fix is totally working fine uh, one thing i always say for the hood fix to be sure like these two graphs have to be similar in color only the right one will be with the hood the center one will be without the hood and the color of these two tiles should be same color and graphics if the colors and graphics are little bit different i will show you in a second uh, if i enable the extended hood fix you can see this one have very darker color right now the hood fix is not working and it is uh, being showing fake frames so yeah make sure your colors of these two bottom tiles are totally similar so there we go now if this video helps you uh, consider subscribing to the channel join discord if you are facing any kind of issue and more cheap games and everything and i will see you guys in the next one so cheers now